Madrid win their 15th Champions League in their 6th in 11 years. Wow. I should have known the outcome when I saw the insane fact that Madrid have never lost a Champions League final in their history. No guys, not the Europa Cup. You can take the man out of Chelsea, but you cannot take the Chelsea out the man. Isn't that right, Ian Matson? Guys, I told y'all. Give Vinny two more stellar seasons, and he's comfortably in that Neymar conversation. Some of y'all are not ready for that conversation. Some of y'all too scared to start that conversation. But I am. Let me know in the comments. I just knew when Adeyemi missed those chances that the match was pretty much settled. This is like that unspoken rule in football. It's like someone places a weird hex on the players in big games. Because no matter what they do, they will be unable to get the ball in the back of the net. I mean, look! You mean to tell me this nigga missed a... Hell no! Madrid are so annoying. They love sucking the soul out of their opponents because they started playing football in the 80th minute. Huge shout out to Chelsea and Lionel Messi for standing against this decade of Satanism. Is this nigga serious? I will give Danny Carvajal his flowers though because he, he truly is an underrated fullback and he should retire as one of the best to ever play the game. It's not even crazy to say that Dortmund gave Madrid more of a challenge than any other club in the past uh, in recent years. This was definitely how a final should be played with the constant back and forth counterattacks, crazy fouls, the, the, the ultras from b both sides. Like It felt like both teams had a 12th man on the field because Dortmund has some crazy passionate fans. Uh -huh.